Have you ever wondered what is at the end of space? A question that has sparked curiosity in the minds of humans for generations. Our fascination with the cosmos is as vast as the universe itself. It's a realm full of mystery, a canvas painted with stars, galaxies, and nebulae, all dancing to the tune of cosmic forces beyond our comprehension. From the earliest astronomers, gazing up at the starlit sky with naked eyes, to the modern scientists peering into the depths of the universe with powerful telescopes, we have always been drawn to the unknown, the unexplored. And one question has remained a constant throughout this journey of discovery. What lies at the end of space? Is it a wall of fire, a gateway to another dimension, or perhaps an endless expanse of nothingness? This question might seem simple but the answer is far from it. Before we dive into theories about the end of space we need to understand the concept of the universe. The universe in all its infinite mystery is a term that refers to the totality of existence, everything that we know and everything that we don't. It's a vast mind-boggling expanse that stretches out seemingly without end. Imagine if you will a cosmic tapestry woven with countless galaxies. These galaxies like islands in the cosmic ocean are teeming with stars. Each star, a blazing beacon of light and heat, may be the central hub for a solar system, complete with planets, moons, asteroids, and comets. These celestial bodies are the building blocks of the universe, each contributing to the grand cosmic ballet. But the universe is not just about what we can see, it's also about the unseen. The black holes, for example, are like cosmic vacuum cleaners, sucking in everything that comes too close, even light itself. These cosmic phenomena are not just fascinating, they're key to understanding the universe's structure and evolution. And then, there's dark matter. This elusive substance is believed to make up about 85% of the universe's mass, yet, it does not interact with light or any other form of electromagnetic radiation, making it virtually invisible. Despite this invisibility, its gravitational effects are observable, and it plays a fundamental role in holding galaxies together. The universe is not just a collection of galaxies, stars, and planets. It's a complex dynamic system where everything is interconnected. The birth and death of a star, the spiraling dance of galaxies, the mysterious pull of dark matter. Each event, each entity, has a part to play in the cosmic symphony. Understanding the universe is like trying to comprehend an intricate puzzle with an unfathomable number of pieces. It's vast, it's complex, and it's ever-changing. Yet, it's this very complexity and vastness that make it so captivating, so alluring. Now that we have a grasp on what the universe is, we can delve into the theories about its boundaries. Scientists have proposed several theories about what could be at the end of space. Let's dive into the deep end of these cosmic conjectures. The first one is the infinite universe theory. As the name suggests, this theory posits that the universe is infinite with no end or edge. It's like a never-ending story but with galaxies, stars, and black holes instead of fantastical creatures and magical kingdoms. Imagine setting off on a journey, traveling at the speed of light, and never reaching a final destination. You'd continue to encounter galaxies, stars, and other cosmic bodies forever and ever. It's a mind-boggling concept, isn't it? But that's the beauty of the infinite universe theory. The second theory is the closed universe theory, also known as the cyclic or oscillating universe theory. This theory pictures the universe as a kind of cosmic Russian doll, where everything that exists is contained within a finite space. But here's the twist, the universe is curved, not flat. It loops back on itself, creating a closed, self-contained system. So if you were to set off on a cosmic journey, you'd eventually end up back where you started, like a spacefaring boomerang. It's a little like walking around the surface of a giant cosmic balloon, except in three dimensions, not two. Finally, we come to the multiverse theory. This is the theory that our universe is just one of many, a single bubble in a vast cosmic foam. Each of these universes could have different physical laws, different dimensions, even different versions of you and me. It's like a cosmic lottery, with infinite possibilities and endless variations. If this theory is true, then what lies at the end of our universe could be the beginning of another entirely different universe. Whether it's an infinite stretch, a loop, or a multiverse, each theory presents its own set of questions and possibilities. Is there an edge or boundary to the universe? If the universe is infinite, how does it accommodate the finite amount of matter and energy we observe? If it's closed, what's outside the loop? And if it's a multiverse, how can we ever hope to explore or understand these other universes? These are questions that have puzzled, intrigued, and inspired scientists for centuries. They spur us on in our quest to understand the universe and our place within it. 
They remind us that while we've come a long way in our understanding there's still so much we don't know. The universe is a mystery, a grand cosmic puzzle, and we as curious beings are forever trying to piece it together to make sense of the cosmos and our place within it. So, as we gaze up at the night sky we can't help but wonder, what lies at the end of space? And that my friends is a question that continues to fuel our quest for knowledge and understanding. It's a question that drives us to explore, to learn, to reach for the stars, and to imagine what might lie beyond the boundaries of our current understanding. Whether it's an infinite stretch, a loop, or a multiverse, each theory presents its own set of questions and possibilities. Our quest to answer the question of what lies at the end of space has led us to explore the cosmos like never before. The vastness of space, once a mystery shrouded in the darkness of the unknown, is now a canvas for a plethora of investigations, discoveries, and advancements. The role of space exploration in our understanding of the universe cannot be overstated. It's through this exploration that we've been able to gather invaluable data and insights about the cosmos. Tools like telescopes, space probes, and missions have been instrumental in this quest. Telescopes, our eyes into the infinite, have allowed us to observe celestial bodies and phenomena millions of light years away. They have given us a glimpse into the past, as the light we perceive from distant stars and galaxies embarked on its journey to us many years ago. Space probes, on the other hand, are our hands reaching out into the cosmos. Probes like Voyager 1 and 2 have journeyed to the outskirts of our solar system, sending back data that has drastically reshaped our understanding of the universe. And then, there are the manned and unmanned space missions, our daring leaps into the unknown. From the iconic Apollo missions that took us to the moon to the Mars rovers that roam the red planet, these missions have expanded our horizons, bringing the cosmos closer to us than ever before. Each of these tools plays a unique role in our quest. They are our means to seek answers, to push boundaries, and to venture into the great unknown. They allow us to probe deeper, to see farther, and to understand better. They fuel our curiosity and drive our determination to unravel the mysteries of the universe. Space exploration not only brings us closer to answering our question, but also opens up a world of discoveries and possibilities. As we continue to explore, we continue to learn, and as we continue to learn, we continue to grow. And perhaps in this growth, we may one day find the answers we seek. As we ponder the question of what lies at the end of space, we are reminded of the vastness of the universe and our place within it. We've journeyed together exploring the complex and intriguing concept of the universe, a vast expanse that stretches far beyond our comprehension. A cosmic ocean in which our home, Earth, is but a mere speck of dust. We've delved into the multitude of theories that endeavor to explain what could be at the universe's end. From the big freeze to the big crunch, the big rip to the big bounce, each theory presents a unique and fascinating perspective on the ultimate fate of our universe. Yet, despite our best efforts, the universe's end remains shrouded in mystery, a cosmic enigma that continually eludes our grasp. Our journey also took us through the realm of space exploration, the human endeavor that pushes the boundaries of our knowledge and understanding. Space exploration, driven by our innate curiosity, is our torch in the dark, a beacon that guides us through the cosmic wilderness. It's our attempt to unravel the mysteries that the universe holds, to seek answers to questions that have intrigued us for millennia. As we've seen, the quest to understand what's at the end of space isn't just about finding the physical boundary of the universe, if there even is one. It's about understanding the universe itself, its origins, its structure, its evolution, and ultimately its fate. It's about deepening our understanding of the cosmos and our place within it. So, what is at the end of space? The truth is we may never know for certain, but the quest for answers continues to drive our exploration and deepen our understanding of the universe we're a part of.